Well, today we were here for the rededication of Ariel Anniker's uh, garden at Trade Winds Elementary. And what a beautiful day it was. We even had a shower. And uh, even though Ariel did not survive her, her cancer, something did survive, and that was her memory. And a beautiful rededication of a butterfly garden on her behalf in Butterfly Capital of the World. Her mother, through her foundation, and their entire family and supporters from Coconut Creek and Tradewinds Elementary have made it possible to keep her memory alive right here where she went to school. Tradewinds Elementary is near and dear to my heart because all three of my children attended here and I love Tradewinds. Um, just regardless of the fact that they have Ariel Anniker's Butterfly Garden here, the school's phenomenal, the teachers are wonderful, the, everybody's just always been great and I've always had a wonderful experience for my children and myself. I am beyond proud of my students. Um, back in September, when we couldn't even touch a recess ball and I had two kids, they were like, Miss Honey, what can we do at recess? And I'm like, well, let's try gardening because we had a garden and needed some help. And so they came out, they planned the space, they, 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 they came with a pair of scissors, they cut down. This was a jungle and we were able to come out every day, plant, weed, pull, limbs cut and before you know it we were back. Before it was like a jungle. Um, the vines on the trees were out of control and I needed some TLC. Uh, we got our step ladder, some snips and we done the balancing act. We got up there and removed all the vines. It worked out pretty good. I am beyond proud and so thankful for my students for doing this and for the Trevelli family and to bring this happiness and peace back to Tradewinds. The Ariel Anniker Cancer Foundation was founded in 2009 as a promise to Ariel, my daughter who passed away from bone cancer, and I promised her that I would start a foundation that was going to help needy pediatric cancer families, children with cancer, needy families who couldn't pay their bills because we were one of those families once. When she was sick, we were going through hard times. So my promise to her and my slogan, one mother, one daughter, one promise, that's what we're doing on a daily basis to try to work very hard to raise funds so we can help these needy families that have kids with cancer. That's our main mission.